Welcome back to another arm wrestling simulator video. Today we're doing new pro but with the best pet. Our current best pet is this ghost haunted pumpkin that does 164 million. And then we also have two best friend sevens to help us with our journey. First we'll just train some strength so we can defeat the boss. And we can already defeat it after one punch. We are starting with two super rebirths so we start with 300% on the rebirth percentages. Fine. Now we can defeat the champion and get 15k wins to escape to the next area. Wow, we only get 625 wins, it's not very much. There we go, we've got 15.6k wins, so we can now escape school and go into the gym. Luckily with these pets we've got now, we won't have to spend any wins on any of these eggs, so we can spend them all on trails and rebirths. First thing we need to do now is just get a trail, just give us a bit more strength. Let's train a bit more, and then, wow, we get 300 billion each punch. We can already defeat the last boss. We've got to get 20 million wins to get to the next area, that shouldn't take too long. There we are, we've got 24.3 million wins, we can go to the next area, the beach. For this area, it looks like we're going to need 1.7 QA strength, but on these free player accounts, you normally need a little bit more than what it says, so let's get 2 QA. We can also get a better trail with our 24 million. Oh, I forgot about arms. We do have arms from... Do another challenge on this account. We won't use them. Let's try. Let's open them up, and then we can just use whatever keys we need to get. We'll delete all these ones from now. Now we can train arms, uh, train knuckles until we get two QA strength. Shouldn't take us too long. We're getting one point five trillion each time we train. There we go, we've now got 2 QA strength, that means we should be able to defeat the Kraken boss, there we go. Yeah, it looks like we're going to be able to. There we go, we've defeated it. We need 5 trillion wins to get to the next area, let's get that real quick. We can stop fighting the Kraken boss now because I think we should have enough arm crates. Okay, we have none. Alright, instead we're gonna fight this friendly shark so we can get some arm crate keys so we can get a better arm and defeat this boss quicker. Let's do that. Now we're up to 500 billion wins, so let's have a check of how many arm crates we've got now. We have five gold crates that we can open, let's use them. And our new best arm does 350%, that's going to help a lot. We are now up to 9.3 QA strength with using that arm. Let's defeat this Kraken boss and get to the next world. And we now have 5.1 trillion wins after defeating that Kraken boss a little over 1.2k times. I think that might have been including the other challenges as well, but it was a lot of times. It's been about an hour. We can now finally go to the bunker and keep training until we can defeat that boss. But we should have some more crates that we can open for some arms. Yes, we do. We have seven more gold ones. Let's open those up. And yeah, we've got a better arm, a 420% buff bio. Let's use that. That should speed our progress up quite dramatically. And then we can train biceps and use the big barbell to get up to the 150 QA we need. So probably about 200 QA. Should take us too long. We're getting 118 trillion each time we kill this barbell. And we can also buy a better trail. This 5 trillion, 1.5 trillion one here. And you know what, let's do some rebirths as well. We'll spend all of our wins. There we go, now we're doing 1050% more. 
So we get a 339 trillion per bicep curl, basically. We're now strong enough to defeat the Mutant King. We've got one QI strength. If you guys are enjoying the video, please like and subscribe. It really does help. And also comment what you don't like about the video so I can change that. We now have enough strength to defeat the Mutant King. Let's fight him. Get the 50 QI wins we need to go to the next area. Which is going to take a lot of defeating this boss. This boss only gives us a small amount of wins. Let's have a look now. Yeah, it gives us only 240 QD wins, so we're going to have to defeat this boss a lot of times. And we now have 53 QI wins to go to the next area. So we can do that now. And then we can also do some more reverse and open some more arm crates. Let's see if we've got any arm crates to open. We have 17 gold crates that we can open. Let's do that. And we got an even better armor, 445%. I think that's one of the best ones in the crate. Yeah, it's one of the best. We can still get better. Then we can look at trails. We can get this 20 QI trail and do some rebirths. And there we go. Now we're getting a 1.6k percentage increase. So we can go back to the last world and train back the biceps again to defeat the, the boss. So we'll grab the dumbbell, head back to the new area and train until we can defeat the boss. We need uh, one QI strength. We get about we'll get about ten so we can defeat it quickly. We now have five QI strength so we can defeat the mammoth boss and then get our five SX wins to go to the next area. Let's do that now. The mammoth boss should be pretty easy for us to defeat. Yeah, it's very easy and it gives us 175 QM wins, so let's get going. And that's it for this episode of Armour Racing Simulator. If you did enjoy, please remember to like and subscribe, it really helps. And make sure to watch the next video on screen now.